approaches, goes past his new teammate. So Scotty Pye ooh, had a terrible year in 2013, had some of the biggest crashes we've seen in the category. Rear corner of the Holden Racing Team car. Here's the replay. Garth Tander Ouch. into a frenzy to qualify. And then if you're in the top ten, here's the replay of Gizzy. Look at this. Whack. There goes the... Oh, uh, yeah, whatever. It uh, didn't affect me. I wish I could say that that... Uh, it, you know, cost me four tenths, but it had. Neil correctly pointed out that oil then has come under the rear tyres. He's fired himself in at turn five. Richie Gartander and Jason Bright were really lucky not to get well, caught up in yeah. Chaz's oh. mishap. So this is David Reynolds. Incidentally, he's still in pit lane, so that damage on the front right-hand corner. But then you've got to, first of all, deal with potentially the damage on the tyre. This is Nick, Nick Perkett and Michael Caruso in the same spot in strife down here as well. That was... Oh, oh. And that's the reason why Dale Wood's in the pit lane. Well, he was an innocent bystander in that one. Back here at Clipsal, and look at this crunch for James Courtney. In with Any time you go narrow into turn eight, Oh, oh he got a little touch. bump. It was a touch as well. The guy's behind. So here's a replay. What's the story here? So oh, that uh, Russell. Rusty. Russell into Dale Wood and then Jack didn't get tagged. He just had nowhere to go. It's Percat, the South Australian, Van Gisberg and the Kiwi. Another Kiwi behind him in Coulthard. Another local boy in Tim Slade behind oh, him. Oh, in the wall oh, for Percat. Percat has gone into the wall front left. Unfortunately, under pressure, and he's off down the escape road at nine. What a shame. Out of third position. OK, Mick, we've seen that. We've seen that. Talk to me. That's Alex Somerset. Talking to Nick. Car 34 of Robert Dahlgren makes another journey through the pit lane. OK, restart time. Puts it in the hands of Shane Van Gisbergen in the acceleration zone. Look at them all spread out. They go in search of their own piece of real estate. They bump and grind and push and shove. And now they've got to come all back together again. Oh! One, two, one. Jason Bright over and over and up and into the wall. Oh. That started with Slade right, down the Bob, inside. Bob, okay. Okay. Wind Cup into the side of Caruso. The Norton's gone, and so too is Wind Cup. We would have known that was coming. And this will show us Nick Perk at car triple two. Just giving the hip and shoulders to Mark Winterbottom. Have another crack here. Here's the replay onto the front straight on the last lap. Wind Cup moved him right over. Too far. Oh, how close do you Too like far. It? And I wouldn't be surprised if there's a little bit of an investigation into that one. Another angle here. Here we go. Sorry, it's... Yeah, Tander and Mostert coming together. Wind Cup doing well to avoid all that. Look at the others taking evasive action as well. Jackson Perk here. Here's the out. Uh, Wind Cup's dive down the inside. Oh, oh, no! Kelly and Caruso touching. Watch the head, mate. Watch the head for rubble. A fair amount of traffic to deal with out there at the moment. Check this replay out. We're looking at Mark Winterbottom, centre of screen, and then arrives at the corner with a lock break as Jack departs the pit lane and goal line. So that's uh, it's going to be an issue. Oh, here, he's look at this up inside. the front. As oh, contact. contact. That Wind sends Lowndes off. Incredible. The teammates made contact. The leader of the race the goes track. off. Get the slides point. way back. James Courtney, Robert Dahlgren, Michael Caruso, Will Davison, all finding trouble in one way, shape, one way or another here. So just trying to keep my eye on Will to see. No, we still can't see that. And that's Dahlgren. And the uh, slow-mo replay down at turn two, and Garth's on the dirt. He launches the AMG car up onto two wheels with a massive shunt. And on the out, driving infringement. And this was the stuff that... Neil's referring to. Look at that! That's Van Gisberg and right up in the air into the sun. Bang! Right front to left rear. Uh, wheel to wheel. And I reckon that's just given that, in fact, it ended up with such a big trailing. In fact, he's so close, Van Gisberg can have a look by the turn, the time they get to turn one. Oh, there's going to be contact here! Oh, he oh. manages to get on safely. And oh, then he goes. Slade, off into the fence, lost it backwards. That 
was clumsy. And there's caught. Grabbed out of the way. Hopefully it can so we can keep racing. Oh, oh big trouble here. Percat makes massive contact with Reynolds. And off they go at seven. So that's Russell Ingle in front of us. Who is now 12. And watch this. Oh, that's seized because of that. Mistake down here between turns three and four in practice one. Got it all wrong. Had good quality tyres on at the time. Crosses it up, locks it up, buries it in the kitty litter down there, but fortunately stayed off the fence. But they have got no pace, and that was the plague. In Cup did, got onto the grass at three, which ricochets him across the road down at four and nudges into the tyre wall. This is at over 200 kilometres an hour, sideways, wet grass, right out to the fence. Oh! Gives it a bump, but this could have been big. He gathers it up. This is the bit that really could have hurt. That bit there has finally, lucky there's enough road with the pit. Jason Barguana, oh. look at that, my goodness. So I think that was Mostert. Yep. Mostert having a battle there with Wall. I think it was a handful, but they come out of one rather than that. Whoa, that is, no, it's a solo. That is absolutely out of control. He's backed over that big tall curb. Right out sideways for Chaz Mostert. But he did a good job there, and now Slade down the inside. He's gonna push him wide. Bright holds his ground. Slade goes a long way. Bright pushes him into the grass. Slade bounces back and punches the left-hand front wheel right. And he does. Oh, Van Gisbergen. Big, bold move on the outside of Frosty. And there's a little touch on the exit and into the Someone wall goes Jason Bright. Bright. So Bright now... Both decided to go through the little shortcut. And then... Oh! <laughs> Jamie...